Hey you guys, I'm Mrs. Platt, the Innovation Specialist at Washington Woods Elementary, and today I'm here to do a book talk with you. So something fun I'm doing this summer is a family neighborhood book club. It's very casual, a great way to connect with families, and also a good way to practice good reading skills over the summer. So if you've not tried a family neighborhood book club, I highly recommend it. We're having a lot of fun, and we've just gotten started. Um, so the way we started this was we created a list of books using Goodreads. It's an app that gives book reviews. Um, and then from that big list, our tweens, who are 10, just finished fourth grade, created their own top three list. And that's how we compiled in the votes and tallies and came down to our selected book choice for our first round. So I was so excited when the kids chose Lois Lowry's Number the Stars. And that is the book that I'm going to do a book talk on today. So here's the cover. And as you can tell, it's a great book. Uh, it was voted for a Newbery and won a Newbery Award. Um, the story was written almost 20 years ago. Um, and the reason why I was so excited the kids chose it is because when I was in fourth grade, I also loved this book. So I want to talk to you about it today. So the setting is during World War II, during the Holocaust, and it is set in Copenhagen, Denmark. The main characters are two little girls named Anne Marie and Ellen. They're both 10. And at this time, the Jews are being relocated um, from Denmark. And just as this is happening, Ellen, who is Jewish, um, goes to live with her best friend Anne Marie to escape the relocation. But just as she has moved in with the Johansson family, Anne Marie is asked to go on a dangerous mission that could save Ellen's life. So it's a great story about friendship and bravery. It also is a good example of how kids can make a difference in the world and how they can be leaders by the choices they make, whether they be um, scary choices or not so scary choices. Um, but the key um, to this story is bravery and friendship. And so I just love this book and I know you will too. Again, probably the age um, range would be 10 and up just because of the content of the story but we are having so much fun reading it together. And if you've not tried out Neighborhood Family Book Clubs, uh, you should totally give that a shot this summer. So I hope you enjoy reading and enjoy your summer, and we will see you soon.